Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Sly Cooper. Oh, shit. <laughs> Sly Cooper with Chaos Counseling. The Thievius Raccoonus. See, where is the other So one? there's two left. Oh, there's two left? Yes. I thought I only needed two more keys. You do need two more keys. I just thought that would take me to a boss. No. Mm, no. Yeah, there's Whatever. two more keys. Dang it. Oh, well. Yeah, no. It do matter, though. I meant it didn't matter that I fell off because I took Oh, is out. this? I'm trying to. Oops. Oh, we... There's one level that I'm interested to see how you guys feel about it. Okay. But, like, oh, wait, in a good way? If that's. I don't know. I kind of like that level in a weird way. <laughs> this doesn't help anything. This helps nothing. But I think it's this one. Sneak. Or don't. I can usually take him out. No, you can. Yes, I can. <laughs> Those ones always kill you. No, they really don't. You gotta sneak up behind them. Gotta yeah, be sneaky. Sneaky. Oh, wrong button. Hello, buddy. How you doing? <laughs> Time to go nap, nap. I hope it's fine. <laughs> oh, watch out. Hmm. Two to tango. This is what I was thinking of. Oh, boy. Here we go. What the hell? What's with the giant bulldog, man? That's what the bulldog guy... That's mugshot. Yeah, well, That's yeah, but like, what? Like. These rooftops are filthy. Well, they are the only way to get to the key, since my locator tells me it's in a jewel case somewhere near Mugshot's penthouse. Hello. How are you doing this fine evening, sir? Oh! Is his he penthouse a gosh darn fire hydrant? Yes. They established this earlier, but yes, it is a fire hydrant. That's hilarious. It's amazing, isn't it? I love it. Mm. Yes, because there's a magnet in the end of my cane that just pulls me towards yes. the fire. Well, 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 look who just walked into my crosshairs. Sly Cooper. About time you showed up, Miss Fox. Was getting worried about you. Thought you took a wrong turn somewhere back in Paris. The only one making wrong turns is you, Sly. I'd suggest you surrender before I paralyze you with my good friend, the shock pistol. Now see, a girl whose best friend's a firearm's got issues. A little dinner, a little dancing. I think I can help you out. Mm, sounds romantic. As long as you don't mind dining in jail. Nah, I hear the service is lousy. <laughs> Once I catch you, you'll know for yourself. <laughs> Bless her. <laughs> I love it so much. I love their banter a lot. Oh man, having to find all the bottles while running. Yep. Yeah. Luckily, it's not too hard. There are some sections where it's a little bit harder, but... Honestly, this kind of reminds me of the helicopter chase from Spider-Man on the N64. Yeah, some, I'll take your word. Sometimes it's not yeah, it's too... Not sometimes it's not too bad. Some sections are a little bit harder than others, but, like, honestly, it's not too bad. I just love having her in the background. Maybe I shouldn't say it's not a great game. I just don't think it's aged particularly well, just given how many games Spider-Man has had over the years. It was good for the time, I think is the best way to describe it. Yeah. Have a fun there, Carmelita. Not as much fun as you'll be having when I shoot your face! So, well, no, see, I'm at least you're gonna be looking at my face. <laughs> so, I'm pretty sure this game came out around the same talk as Star time as Star Fox Apertures. What was with- Tem Oops, I Tem thought it was gonna crash into the building. Nope. What was with this time's period's obsession with sexy fox women? I mean, why not? Yeah, I mean, <laughs> foxers. Because they're foxy! <laughs> yeah, I think that one. <laughs> I'm a little oh, sad it took me that long to come a... up with that. <laughs> oh, man. But I mean, it probably has to do with. Uh, then again, maybe not. I, this is the only, just the first instance I could think of of anthropomorphized female foxes was Disney's Robin Hood. So that I mean, was that was a yeah that was a long that time was like ago, in the well, I was so, so, no, 70, 80? It's called Robin Hood. Just Robin Hood. Disney's Robin when Hood. When did Disney's Robin Hood come out? Seventies. Seventies. Okay. Nineteen seventy-three. If you heard from so, Siri. Honestly, that's one of my favorite Disney movies. It's really good. I love that movie. 
Oh, you okay. Should... I thought I could like crawl all around the side. Did you see the gar the sparkly spoos? Be quiet, honey. <laughs> Sly, there's a blue orb. <laughs> Sly. <laughs> Hush, Gregory. I'm searching. <laughs> I bet, like, I actually in one of my Harvest Moon games when I got a dog. I like had talked to my mom. I was like, "What should I name this dog?" And she's like, "You know, one of the dogs I used to have, I named it Bentley." And I paused and I was like, "She doesn't know about Sly Cooper, right?" <laughs> you named her Bentley, mom. <laughs> but, but then I did name that dog Bentley. Perfect. So. Yeah, okay, I guess. Oh wait, no. It's because we go this way. Yeah. Yeah. No. Not for that. Anyway. No. But friggin' yeah, that's that's the only thing I could think of is like, oh, I bet you anything that was an awakening for a lot of people. <laughs> Yeah. I don't know. I'm one of those people that it's like I can I like the way furries look. I just don't find any like physical attraction to them. I don't know if that I think that still might count as a furry. I, I, don't don't know, I admit man. I know furries have gotten a really bad reputation. They have. Thanks to a select group of the community, yeah. Yeah, select. Like community. any community has. They always have. That's so true. What the fucks everywhere. So. I mean, I just know that thanks to watching the Redwall show and it being one of my favorite books, anthropomorphized animals have always been kind of a cool idea for me personally. Oh, come on! Thank you! <laughs> Again, I really wonder if there's something weird with, like, the new collection where you're having so much trouble with controls. Yeah. It must be. Or maybe oh, I'm just coming across as a giant dick. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think it's it's definitely a case of, like, with Beyond Good and Evil, I was confused that Luke was having so much trouble. But it's like, you know, maybe it's just, uh, I played it too many times yeah. and I got so good at it. So it's like, any fault with the controls? I worked around and forgot existed. <laughs> yes. You rolling? Uh, don't do it. It's okay. How am I supposed to take care of that person? You um, can climb up. Um, yeah, there was a hole? There's a, yeah, there's a hole on the side. Um, I'm sorry for backseat gaming, I'll be better. It's hard when you're, it's like, no, wait, ah! <laughs> then I'm like, wait, I want to help! Oh, wait, I'm gonna do better, I'm sorry. The dice door scared me, I was like, where did the flying dice come from? You're like, ah! <laughs> That's the new weapon Carmelita got. <laughs> She's just adapted to the environment. That's oh, all. for sure. <laughs> but yeah, As all can. police women do. Yeah, you can bounce on that mattress when you get a second. I'm not sure get you up. Destroy him. Finish him. Shoot. Well, I still have some more level to go, so. Yeah, but it should be somewhere close by, I think. Ah, it's back there! Ah, eh, crap. I don't think there's any way we can... No, let me clear check, though. Must have been somewhere in... When you were running from her. Yeah, because it's at the top. So, right there. Oh, now we know for when we do a rerun again. Yeah. That's not a long segment, so. Not really. And especially if you're just avoiding Carmelita, you could just, like, literally just keep going. The main reason I said that is because you're in a chase scene. Oh, 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 oh! All 
Apparently you need to calm your tits. No, she will stop at nothing to catch you. She will stop at nothing to get you in her arms. I mean, what? <laughs> what? I mean, arrest you for jail purposes. Yes. Yeah. Um, in the have, bedroom. She's got the handcuffs. <laughs> right. Okay. There's the thing, my doodle. Game over. Oh, oh we can get the bottle. Hey! Got a horseshoe. No, nah, we lost it a while ago. When when Carmelita first attacked and you fell, that's where we lost yeah. it. Yeah. We glue red. We glue. We glue. <laughs> we glue. <laughs> I didn't know glue was made out of raccoons. Glue is made out of bones, ain't it? So any bones would work, right? I you thought glue was made out of fat. Oh, I don't know, man. Clearly we don't know what glue is. <laughs> oh, wait, no, I'm thinking of jello. <laughs> oh, yeah, gelatin is made out of bones. I did not know that, yeah, actually. Yeah, gelatin's made out of horse bones. Huh. Actually, I think you can make it out of... I think you can make it out of any bones, but I just remember being told horse bones I did not know that. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> yeah, gelatin is... That's kind of terrifying. Wait, how does bones pick up gelatin? Uh, um, it's, it's the thing it has something to do with like the substance. I mean, because gelatin was originally a thickening agent, not just something you ate on its own. But then when people realized that you know gelatin mixed with fruit flavor made actually a kind of tasty dessert, uh, yeah, that's kind of where. Jello. I mean, it probably goes through it, not like an exact process like this, but I mean, um, harp strings are made out of intestines, so. Wait, what are what? Harp, harp strings. Harp strings. You know, for the musical instrument, what, what? Maeve plays. Yeah, they, those strings are made out of intestine. How? Um, through a very long, um, curing, stretching, um, and twisting process. Huh. It. Yeah, it's. I found that out through. I forget how. Oh yeah. How did I miss that? Uh. Oh, that's mm. life. All right, now we can get the safe. Yay! Hi, bud. Hi, doggo. But yeah, like, we humans are oh, very creative uh, on in the ground. how we use things. Which I'm like, hey, don't waste not want not, right? I mean, I guess, but it's so bizarre. I know. <laughs> Sorry. Who sat down <laughs> I mean, you know that mead used to be made with blood, right? No! <laughs> I didn't! I was peacefully unaware of the fact that we're cannibals. <laughs> well, actually, the idea, it wasn't made with human blood. It was made with goat blood. The oh, Navajo Code Talk, by the way. Huh? Good thing I know Navajo Code Talk. Oh, okay. Again. Yeah, definitely Midwest stuff. <laughs> yep, early 2000 game as well. Suzanne Cooper's notes pertaining to water safety. With this knowledge under your belt, you won't have to waste a charm whenever you fall into water. Yay! Okay. Another amazing reason why you should always go after. So now we the can vaults. fall in water without issue. Yep. Um. Even if it's by accident, I don't encourage you to continually fall into water. But. But yeah, no, it was made with goat's blood. I think the general idea was. Again, this is just speculation from what I've seen with, like, other societies with their use of alcohol and other things like that. The idea was by cooking goat's blood into the alcohol, it was something Vikings could drink while on ships that would keep them warm and would give them the protein they need to keep uh, sailing without having actual food. Ah. I think. I could be 100% wrong, and I'm just, dang it, making speculation out of... You know, just things that I've heard about other various societies. Is the camera societies. stuck at this angle? No. Oh. Because yeah. <laughs> I'm like, I don't remember you doing it that way with yeah. the first time. I didn't want to say anything, but I was like, maybe this is just how we play. I just need to learn this. <laughs> That's so just, weird, though. I'm just kind of used to other games that have sections like this not being able to move the camera. I mean, I understand. Yeah, there is a lot of stuff. Get on there. I'm gonna hunt you down, Cooper. You can't run forever. I think I can. <laughs> she just flies away on an inflatable mugshot. It's like, yeah, I'm willing to <laughs> bet that I totally could run, keep running away forever. I'm the best at that. Yeah. <sighs> That's my name, I think. <laughs> All right. Okay, well, we have like two minutes left. What do you guys want? 
All right, uh, we'll see you guys next time. Okay, bye. 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 Nice to see you, Carmelita. Miss you.